Hi everyone, uh, it's me, Mr. McNichol. Uh, how's it going, integrated reading and writing? Well, first off, I'm feeling better. I am really sorry if any of you ended up in class without me there. I sent out an announcement, but uh, I did not realize that I also had to call my department head. I'm still kind of new at this, so I did eventually. Uh, I'm hoping you got the you guys got the message stuck on the door by five o'clock. Um, but anyways, we're going to be back on track on Tuesday, so I hope everybody's getting this. I'm hoping everyone's watching this and reading the announcements as well. So your rough draft for your Common App essay was due on the 21st. Okay, that was two days ago. If your rough draft isn't in, please get it in. Okay, because I want to be able to give you guys feedback. Some of you guys did amazing. I'll be giving you more feedback as time goes on. I am over the flu finally. I can walk around and I am not holding my guts in with my hands, it seems. So um, what's going to happen is this. I want to see this happen on Tuesday. I would like everybody to bring in their rough drafts. Okay. Uh, now, if Mr. McNichol, I'm having a little bit of a trouble writing that rough draft. No problem. Makes sense. Remember those outlines you gave me. Remember we had all those little things. I started here. Here's my ordinary life. Here's what took me out of that ordinary life. And here was me going down and having difficulty. Here's me at the bottom. I'm never going to be able to do this. And here's how I slowly started to pull myself back up again. And here's where I ended up. Up here. Doing something different. Okay. Maybe you learned how to speak a different language. Maybe you had to get out of a toxic relationship. Maybe you had a terrible dead-end job and you finally told an abusive boss where to get off. Whatever it is. Okay. This is how you can write your essay. Here's the easy way. Okay? Just think of it, you're telling me a story. And go to each step on your outline. If you just said, I had a dead-end job. That was your ordinary life. That was, your, the, that was the first thing. Just give me three sentences about why it was a dead-end job. And then the next one, what brought you out of it? Give me three to five sentences. What brought you out of it? Maybe you saw a coworker who was still doing that dead-end job, and you said, I don't want to be doing that when I'm 60 or something like that. Okay? Tell me all the things that kind of, you know, went made you go lower. I tried registering for classes. I couldn't understand how to even register for classes. This was a problem. This was a problem. Oh my gosh, I thought I'm never going to be able to do this. Okay? And then give me the three or four steps on your way down. Tell me what it was like when you were at rock bottom never thought I could do this because of this, because of this, because of this. I thought I was going to be stuck here forever. Okay, And then tell me the steps you used to go up and tell me what your life is like now and how it's different. Okay? Just take each of those steps and give me three details. That's all you got to do. Three sentences, three details. For each of those steps, you're going to have your rough draft. And it's okay if the spelling is lousy. It's okay if the grammar is lousy. It's okay. That's what a rough draft is for. Okay? Stephen King, best-selling fiction author of all time, said, only God gets it right the first time. He's the best-selling fiction author of all time. Made millions selling books. His first drafts are always awful. Okay? That's the way of it. So, when I see all of you guys again, okay, uh, Bring your rough drafts in on Tuesday because I want you to share them with at least one other classmate. You're going to get feedback from me. You're going to get feedback from at least one, ideally two other classmates. So if you can't, bring in your, not just a rough draft, bring in a paper copy because that is so much easier to work with. Okay? If you can only bring it in on your laptop, fine and dandy. But for Tuesday, Please bring in your rough draft, okay? You'll take your classmates' feedback, and you'll take my feedback that I will put on your pieces. And uh, then I will give you the due date for your final draft, and then we'll move on to other things with integrated reading and writing. Okay, folks? And you will have a brand spanking new essay that you can put into the Common App if you want to go to school anywhere or turn it in for another class if necessary or help modify it for a different class. Can't turn in the same thing twice. That's plagiarism. We'll talk about that. But you get the idea. Okay, folks? 
So, looking forward to seeing you on Tuesday. Bring your rough drafts of your Common App essays, and we'll have a great time. Okay, thanks a whole lot, everybody. You guys take care. Bye-bye.